Around 60% of all IB schools are based in the Americas continent, with around 90% of programmes fully or partially state-funded. Sturgis Public Charter School is one of these schools adopting the IB for All motto, bringing a world-class education to students who may not have been given the opportunity otherwise. Tim Estilos went to Massachusetts to meet them. What do you got back? Well, I could see how those could be perceived as angel wings, but I more saw it as a dove because I thought that that was like the international like symbol of peace is like a oh, dove yeah. carrying oh, an okay. olive branch. Yeah. <laughs> that certainly. <laughs> That certainly clarifies it for me. Yeah. I don't know, Rachel, what do you think about those wings? This is a young mind being challenged to think beyond what's simply on the surface. It's part of the special approach to the IB program adopted by the Sturgis Charter Public School in Hyannis, Massachusetts. It's an approach to teaching that Sturgis has embraced from the start. In 1998, Sturgis received its charter from the state of Massachusetts. Uh, it got started you know, within the sort of year or two prior with a group of parents who had the idea of a, a more challenging world-class opportunity for all kids in the area, and the idea was IB for All. The Sturgis system of IB for All presents the International Baccalaureate in a way that makes it available to everyone. So IB for All at Sturgis means that all of our students, regardless of past personal circumstances, when they are in their 11th and 12th grade years, are going to take all of their coursework in the International Baccalaureate Diploma Program. As a state-funded institution, area students are accepted at Sturgis via a lottery system. Currently, some 800 students are enrolled, with a waiting list of 600. However, the goal of IB for All goes far beyond accessibility. For us, IB for All means the, the dignity of risk. Students decide what they want to do in the IB, and we support them, um, you know, regardless. And so for, for us, IB for All means that all of our kids are going to try and meet their individual potential via this IB program, and success might look different for one student than another, but we're going to help students to realize their dream of success. We're not going to decide for students at ninth or 10th grade, well, this is what you're capable of doing in the IB. The students decide that. I have my point. I have my specific evidence, and I have my explanation. The teachers at Sturgis believe the IB program has an amazing effect on students to strive harder to reach their full potential. I think the kids that come into the, this school here may not necessarily believe that they can learn at high levels. They may have been in a situation that didn't challenge them to their full academic potential. And I think you see the growth in the kids that they, once they realize I can perform at, at a high level in the most rigorous program in the world, that that's really the transformative experience for them. I enjoy its broad nature and the fact that you can cater it to your, what you enjoy. So when you pick your three high level courses and your three standard level courses, if you're interested in science, which I am, I was able to participate in the high level biology because that's something that I want to pursue in my secondary education. The demand for the IB program here at Sturgis has been so impressive and its popularity so widespread that in 2011 the school opened up a second campus nearby to benefit and educate even more young people. At the Sturgis West campus, the IB for All mission continues to have a profound effect on its students, most especially for students like Rebecca White. Rebecca, you're a prime example of how the IB for All motto here at Sturgis works. Explain that. I love my school and I love like the program that I'm in. I definitely would not be where I am today without it. I have a learning disability, so the accommodations that I received and the help that I got have like made me into the person I am today. I um, actually, I used to struggle a lot with English and I'm now taking higher level English and I've maintained a steady BA average in that class for the past two years. We're not looking for perfection or sixes and sevens on all of the IB exams. We really have an emphasis on participation and personal progress.